video, I'm going to teach you some effective ways you can shield your apartment from both high-frequency and low-frequency EMF radiation. The first is by using shielding paints to cover areas that are most vulnerable to EMF radiation. This can be done by using a range of Y-Shield or Block Paint paints, primer and earthing tape. These products can be combined to create a completely shielded space with a reduced EMF exposure. This can be extremely effective against both high-frequency and low-frequency radiation. High-frequency radiation comes from things such as cell towers, 3G, 4G, 5G, Wi-Fi, etc. Low frequency comes from household appliances such as refrigerators and electrical wiring in your home or apartment. Low frequency needs to be reduced as it can result in high levels of body voltage which causes discomfort and severely disturbs your sleep. You can purchase a multimeter off Amazon for a relatively cheap price to measure how much body voltage is present. The paint must be applied in multiple coats along with the Y-Shield primer. Keep in mind that as you are applying the EMF shielding paint, it must cover all areas that are vulnerable to radiation, otherwise you will still be exposed and you will see no change. If you want to know exactly how to apply the products, there is a video link in the description. The next way you can shield your apartment is by using block copper fabric to create a shield around your apartment. Block copper can be utilized in many ways. Using this fabric for underfloor protection can be extremely beneficial as it protects your space from floors beneath if you are living multiple floors up. If you live on the ground floor, this method still applies as there may be a basement or underground pipes or wiring that emit low-frequency radiation. It blocks both high and low-frequency radiation and can be combined with paint, primer and earthing tape to create a Faraday cage. Block copper can also be used for lining curtains, wallets, etc as well as a bed mat that can be used for a Faraday cage. This is if you have a canopy surrounding your whole bed space, connected to the bed mat itself. A third way to shield your apartment is by using dirty electricity filters and other methods to reduce it. Dirty electricity filters help you reduce dirty electricity present on electrical wiring in homes and other buildings, but there are alternative solutions. Dirty electricity can be cleaned using these three methods. The first is switching off appliances, electronics and other devices when you are not using them. The second is swapping fluorescent bulbs for LED or incandescent bulbs. The last is installing dirty electricity filters around the apartment in areas where you spend the most time. You can measure the amount of dirty electricity present in your living space by using a Tri-Field Dirty Electricity Monitor, which can also be purchased from our website. All links are in the description. Carrying out all three steps of this shielding program is the only sensible option for healthy apartment living. For more information and products to help you to reduce EMF exposure, visit our websites and subscribe to this channel.